Hi guys, this is Michael. So Samsung unveiled its latest flagship, the Samsung Galaxy S8 smartphone, which is more expensive than last year's Samsung Galaxy S7, simply because it cost Samsung much more to manufacture each unit of Samsung Galaxy S8. It comes at a price tag of $750, but let us see how much does it actually cost to make one. A company called IHS Market have run a teardown of Samsung Galaxy S8, and here's what it looks like on paper. Touch screen display $85. Rear enclosure $22.5 Rear cover glass $5.7 Cheap set $45 Power management ICs $2.3 RFPA section $5.5 Memory NAND and RAM $41.5 User interface ICs $6.6 Camera module $20.5 Wi-Fi and Bluetooth module $6 Sensors $6.5 Battery pack $4.5 Box content $15, another costs $35. All of these combined, we get to $301.60. Adding to it an estimated manufacturing cost of $5.90, and therefore the total cost comes down to $307.50 for each unit. This means the actual cost of manufacturing a Galaxy S8 is $43.34 higher than that of the S7. It is also higher than the production cost of the Galaxy S7 Edge by $36.29. Now there are other expenses as well for Samsung like research and development costs, cut for retailers and carriers, import fees in different countries and also distribution and administration overheads as well. But again, even after including all these expenses, the margin of profit is pretty high. Here's a list of manufacturing costs of some of the other high-end smartphones. Samsung Galaxy S8 tops the list. So that is all for this video, hope you enjoyed it. Remember to hit that like button and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.